Hey everybody, this is Will at AppAddict.net and today I'm bringing you a new iPhone 5 case review. This being the Spec Pixel Skin HD. Um, this was my favorite, absolute favorite case for the iPhone 4 and 4S. I used it for both of them. You know, when I wasn't um, reviewing cases and testing out cases, this was my go-to case. And I used it in black and they're gray and they're light blue. I used all, so many other colors. I had a plethora of these, the same case for each of my phones because I like to change it up. But um, this was by far my favorite case. It's made out of a TPU, not a silicone, so it's a thicker plastic, which I way prefer because the sides, you won't get junk getting in the side of your iPhone and scratching the back up or anything like that. Um, this case protects all the buttons. It has all the major cutouts. And to me, it was the absolute perfect case. I loved it. It, it stood the test of durability and all of the above. I absolutely love this case. And I just got it in a little while ago. So I'm really impressed the spec came out with this so quickly. So, that, you know, they got it out within days of the iPhone 5's launch, which is incredibly impressive. You can see their logo there. They got the nice cutout for the uh, camera here. It looks like it's the thinner version, so you don't see the line separating the aluminum and the glass of the rear of the iPhone 5. You can kind of see how it looks. You've got cutouts for everything. Interesting take on the bottom here, as you can see the uh, grill for the bottom of the iPhone 5. Of course, the uh, microphone and lightning port. And there we go. So here's the case here, nothing, or the box, nothing fancy, easy to get out. Actually, kind of cool casing. You just lift that up and take the case out. So anyway, um, one thing interesting, it looks like everybody was banking on this uh, iPhone being called the new iPhone, sort of like the iPad. As you can see there, it says new iPhone, not iPhone 5. I bet they'll change that really quickly. It's just a sticker. But um. Yeah, interesting. Obviously, these were made ahead of time. Anyway, so here is the loan case. I'm going to go ahead and pop my iPhone in here real quick. Alrighty, and I'm back here. Now, installing this is, takes extremely, you know, short amount of time. I usually take my time and I use a um, compressed air can and, you know, I like to blow inside the, uh, the case and my ports and all that stuff on here to make sure it's nice and clean what's going in the case. But being a TPU, you just pop pop the top in there and push it right on down. It goes right in. Oh, I love this freaking case. It is, I've been using it for most of today now and uh, well, half of today and I absolutely freaking love it. I, I'm, I'm not surprised at all. All this, the pixel skin cases have been absolutely fantastic. So you can kind of see the bottom and how the grate works. Got ample room for that, great room for that. Everything's lined perfectly. You have the uh, lay on table design here so you can say it, set it upside down. Um, Everything lines up perfectly. Uh, I like this. The uh, mute switch has a lot more room compared to the uh, last case I reviewed, the Belkin. So that's kind of nice. The Belkin, I had to use my nail a couple times to get that switch. But um, mute buttons are, of course, uh, I mean, mute buttons, volume up and down work great. They uh, press really well. Um, you know, I really like the camera cut out on this one. Obviously, like I said, without the iPhone in here, it's cut so perfectly that you don't see the, the aluminum portion of the iPhone 5. So it makes it look really slick. And of course, this gray looks awesome on the white iPhone. So as you can see, go around the side here. You can see their logo here. Um, it's kind of an interesting take. They, they kind of made the sides a little bit more squared, obviously to contour to the new iPhone 5. Um, so it makes it, it adds a really nice grip to the iPhone 5 here. You can feel the lip here. This, this edge is a little, not, sh it's not sharp, but it is a lot more squared off. So it's different than the past Pixel skins, just obviously due to the way the new iPhone 5 works. But you know, you've got the standard issue squares on the back with the glossy interior in between the squares. It's a perfect fit. Everything works great. All the buttons work fantastic. And of course, as usual, people are going to ask me, what sort of screen protector are you using? I am using a crystal clear screen protector. Uh, most of the popular name brands out there have not come out with their, you know, screen protectors just yet. So um, I'm using actually a screen protector by Monoprice. And uh, I think it was a buck fifty for three. And, uh, you know, it works pretty great. And nice crystal clear. I've got some matte finish ones too. They're kind of weird because they do leave the cutout right below the home button open. I don't think you can see it, but right below the home button is actually no screen protector. So kind of annoying. So I'll wait for some power support once to come out, but this in the meantime will do great. So I highly, highly, highly recommend the Pixel Skin HD. It's absolutely fantastic. And spec makes awesome iPhone cases. 
really wish they'd catch up to speed on their uh, iPad cases because I this is by far my favorite case and I know I'll be using this one as my go-to case. So this is the graphite color and they are available now. I ordered mine on Friday and I got it today. So excellent shipping, but I'm also in California and they ship, you know, I think 200 miles north of me. So anyway, I got it really quick. So again, highly, highly, highly recommend the new Pixel Skin HD for the new iPhone 5. Thank you very much, everybody, and have a good one.